Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Hello guys, welcome to my channel. Today in this video tutorial, we are going to learn about installing Visual Studio 2022 on uh, Windows 11. So let's start. So I'll come to this uh, Google Chrome and here I will search for Visual Studio and press enter. Now I'll go to this downloads tab of this Visual Studio and now here we have uh, three different types of Visual Studio one is enterprise one is professional and one is community so this community version is free so we will free download this now it will take some time to install uh, to download the installer so it is uh, almost downloaded now I'll open this so now I'll press continue now it will start downloading now it will start installing this and now it will open a new page So if I go again to this installer, now I have already installed Visual Studio uh, 2022 community version so I will update this. You will install this and I will update this. Now it is starting downloading and then it will uh, install it. Now if I show you the installer again, now you can see that it is an uh, 937 MB file so it will take some time to download and install it so I'll fa pause the video so now if I show you the installer the installation is almost complete it is 95% uh, complete so we have to wait for it uh, to complete 100% so I'll pause it again so now if we check this so now the setup is complete and this page is uh, shown so from here you can select between different environments and can add it in to Visual Studio so I've already selected this .NET desktop development and I will also select this uh, mobile development with .NET now you, you will need 3.91 gigs uh, for this installation so I'll click on this modify and now it will again start downloading all these component and then it will install it now I'll again pass this so now the installation is complete so I'll launch with Studio 2022 so you can see the splash screen of Visual Studio 2022 now I can create a project so I'll create new so here I can select between window form apps and mobile app because I have uh, added Xamarin as well into this so if I select uh, Android so it is not showing uh, anything if I select here from here mobile and now you can see you can uh, select between this uh, mobile app xamarin.form so it is a cross platform app and you can create android app xamarin and you can um, also create um, android wear app xamarin so um, for now I'll select window form app and from here I will select desktop not console but desktop application and from here I select all platforms now from here I'll select this uh, window form app and select next and from here I can get the project name so I'll uh, use a uh, first project and now I'll click create to create the project 
So now the project is created and we have this en uh, empty window form in it. So if I start this project, or run this project, so it will show us this empty windows form. So now the project is running and we have this uh, MD window form on our screen. So I think that's all for today. I hope you like the video. If you like the video, please like, subscribe and comment. Thank you.